Greetings everybody, I am Brian D0313. Welcome more by Advice at Wrathlands Edition. Today we'll be doing a new sort of challenge. We're going to be uh, still using a spider mod. We're also going to be using the universal item pool, but we're going to be using a vanilla type uh, challenge. It's going to be called the, I think it's called the Yes Man Challenge, and that means every single item that you come across, you gotta pick up, regardless of anything. Every single uh, spacebar item you come across, you gotta uh, trade off your current spacebar item and pick up the new one. Yeah, you can't. Uh, can't avoid any items ever. The old devil rooms are definitely pretty ruthless for this run because you got no matter what you have to pick up all deal with devil item items. Uh, shop, I don't know how that really works out because you're supposed to pick up every item, but if you don't have the money, how are you supposed to pick up the shop item? Well, obviously if you go to the shop first, you don't have enough money, but then later on you do get enough money. You had to go back and go to the shop and buy the item? I don't know. Uh, in my opinion, well, for this play, for this playthrough, we're just going to say the shop item is just is the only optional item. I wonder how the chest works out in this in this uh, type of playthrough. Hmm. Because yeah, you go to the chest and there's like four items like, right away. Well, let's have fun. Oh yeah, then there's also the library, which always has two space for items. So we'll so that also plays a factor as well. We're gonna start off with Isaac. Of course, I still have some more uh, universal, like just a uh, regular universal item room uh, playthroughs or item pool playthroughs with uh, what else do I left? Eve. I okay, have Eve, Blue Baby, and Shitty Samson. Remember, you can do this Yes Man run on on a like just a vanilla playthrough. I chose the the uh, universal item pool just because. Well, let's see how interesting things are. Throw that up. And we got our bomb back, plus a soul heart. We're gonna leave the soul heart for now. Because, you know, we want to go into that curse room. Because only a fool will, will skip a curse room. Even if they're playing as Blue Baby, they're fools be skipping curse rooms. I haven't played Binding of Isaac in a while. I've Oh come on! That just pretty much screwed up my chance to deal with Devil, but uh, it is, as I said, deal with Devil might not be that great of a choice for this playthrough, for this challenge. Let's go up here. Found our uh, found our tinted rock. I don't know where the uh, damn it. Uh, I guess we'll come back after we do the, uh, the thing. Yeah, I don't know where the curse room, or, uh, the seat room is. I'm gonna fight the spider, which is gonna be fun. Not. I don't hear people doing that. Fuck you, spider. I don't hear too many people doing the not anymore. Yeah, it's from, like, Wayne's World or something. And nowadays, you got people saying stupid things like, uh, I don't like, uh, YOLO. If I hear anyone say YOLO, I just, they deserve to be punched in the face. What else is stupid? Oh, yeah, hashtag. That's another one of those stupid things that people say these days. Don't forget up lard, because we have to. Look at all the HP. Let's go and head back to that curse room. Oh, yeah, it's something that might, that probably suck. Is if we actually find a dead cat because we're going to pick that up as well. No dead cat, just some flies. That pretty slow right now. So as I was saying, uh, recently I've been playing uh, Me the Metal Gear series. I finished up Metal, uh, Metal Gear Solid 2. Ooh, forget me now. So I have to pick that up, unless if I want to re-roll it, which I am, because I don't want to lose a D6 yet. Cat Nine Tails. I hear that bad things about the sign, but we're gonna pick it up anyway because we have to. HR shot speed go up. I think it's bad because I think it causes knockback as well as uh, reduces the effect of the lump of coal. Because uh, lump of coal works. Uh, the longer your shots are on screen, the better lump of coal works. Since these things are going faster, they're not on screen as much. 
So yeah, I've been playing uh, Metal Gear Solid, finished Metal Gear Solid 2. That was just like a casual playthrough. A lot of alerts. Okay, skip that. Uh, did Metal Gear Solid 3 on normal run. Tried to do a, uh, uh, a no kill. No kill, no alert, and uh, get all the uh, uh, pretty much 100% of uh, the game. Like, get all the. Uh, Get yeah, like all the camos, all the webs, and get all those stupid frogs. Remember, I said I was playing on normal difficulty, so I figured, hey, I do all this, and then after that, I could just uh, uh, carry carry all those items over to uh, extreme difficulty. But apparently, you cannot in Metal Gear Solid 3, which pisses me off because I had all that trouble to get myself killed. God damn enemies! This is what happens when I start talking about random things. I get my ass in here. Come over here. Come over here. A little more. Now just fuck you over. Yeah, so now if I actually want to use those items on uh, extreme difficulty, I have to replay the game on extreme difficulty. Get a fight pin. And because of the health bar, we can actually see where he is, which sort of makes this a little, a little bit more easy. The pin's easy to begin with. How many soul hearts we lost because I was talking about stuff. So I finished Metal Gear Solid 3. Same about doing Metal Gear Solid 4, but I decided to do Peace Walker instead. For my uh, very first time playing it. I guess I really enjoyed Peace Walker. I might give it an 8.2, maybe 8.5. There are some things. Do I really want to go into the deal with Devil Room? Do I want to put up the, pick up the book of Well, I had to pick up the book of Lyle, but I could re roll it into. Oh, cool. That's great. I'll buy a D6. Vision and book revelations. Hey, goodbye, uh, <laughs> goodbye, uh, goodbye, uh, whatever that thing was. Forget me now. Let's see, see where secret room is. So, I'm still playing. Uh, we can see where the uh, shop is. Top secret room there. I'm still playing Peace Walker. I'm, I pretty much finished the main mission. Now I'm just going, uh, playing it for completion. The thing that kind of annoys me is that there's like no uh, actual, uh, can't change like the difficulty of the game. We're not, can't get Bob's Ron head. Yeah, you can't change the difficulty of the game, so. I think it's like, so you're playing the game and it's relatively easy and you want to have the challenge. You want to have, ooh. You want to have that uh, big, get that big boss rank in. And. I don't really think that's in the actual game. Get mom's knife, sweet, good pickup. This don't hurt. Maybe not. Yeah, so can't really get bit. You're gonna find that the game is relatively easy. Be cool if they if they may if they were to make it a little bit harder, but Sadly, I doubt that ever happened. There's only one actual really hard part of the game, and that is, and that is when you have to. Uh, but uh, there's this part where you have to like button mash, and if you don't don't button mash like really, really fast, and you pretty much uh, can't get, get the next part. It really sucks because if you're not good at button mashing, then you. Oh, that's just great, fucking idiots. Uh, if you're not good at button mashing, then you can't really, uh... You should just go over her into, uh... Check out the chest. Then you can't get past the area, and it's like, I kept on failing. I, I was failing, like, the third part, because it's, like... There's three parts to it, like, the first part is, like, eh. Second part is a little, a little more, uh... A bit harder. And the third part is, like, really, really hard. That's usually where I failed. So 
I was like getting really frustrated. I went and I actually had to look up a video on how to actually button mash. Let's move on. And after watching the video, I managed to uh, uh, pass the area. But you shouldn't have to. Uh, sh button mashing shouldn't be like a reason for you to. Uh, there's no skill in it. You don't buy the game to have to button mash. Unless if. So maybe you're playing a multiplayer, a multiplayer game where you're actually up against someone else. You're playing the game for uh, the actual gameplay. I play the game for the e for like uh, uh, being tactical, tactical espionage action, all that. I play the game to just smash buns, more hearts. You might find a blood bane. It's probably blood bane on the last four that I like missed out on. Come after me. Damn you! I should not have been standing there. I'm amazed I didn't take damage. Oh wait, there's pro even floor. This is scary. See? I guess now if I don't do the shop, I have to buy the item regardless. Unless if... If I get like lose more money, fucking greed heads. We'll use our butter rev. Don't get ourselves a cute meat on this floor. I don't know how I feel about that. What do we have here? Two of clubs, doubles, bombs, I believe. Oh, this is. I gotta remember, I don't have the. Uh... I don't have the D6 anymore. We got here. Pill. Let's see what shit this is. Bombs are keys. I mean, damn it. Fuck you, pill. More bombs, just great. I should have never used that uh car. I should have just waited until the floor was over. Don't have to worry about using bombs to get into the seat room anymore. What do we have next? I'm playing really bad. It all started when I all happened when I started talking about Metal Gear Solid. Let's go up here. As I told you, Cuban meat. We don't. Come back. God damn it. Uh, since we're going to the chest, cube meat is decent because we need the orbiters. Yes, I got him. No deal with the devil. It's probably for the best. If we got a deal with the devil, we'll probably end up dying. So no keys, that's not good. Bombs is key card. Lie. We get her. Oh shit, that's gonna blow up the rock. Still no keys, but more bombs. Awesome, right? And. I ran into him. That's just great. Magician, okay. So we can't go to the shop, we can't go to the item room. Actually, we can't go to the item room. I think it. Lost a soul heart there, don't care. Oh crap. I do to use it. I'll buy Book of Revelations. Pick this up, and let's move on. No shop, but I'm, I'm okay. Cool, there's like a bear space bar item. Can I hit this guy? What the fuck? Have I really come across a room that I cannot get past? Nope. 
a mistake. That would have sucked because there are some rooms that you that you can actually uh, end game yourself in. Any people might know what the rooms I'm talking about. Oh, you fucking spider! And that happened again. Here, a fish head. I think the rule also applies to trinkets, except for the de except for uh, the Polaroid. Well, if it doesn't, then we're just going to say it does. Add more challenge to the run. Needs to make uh, health up. What is this thing? Ooh, I believe that this thing uh, gives us uh, eternal hearts. Let's go over this way. We go over here at key for once. Really? There we go. Nope, saw that coming. Oh, there's a heart down here. People are probably tell me. I was stupid to do that. Did I ever get this this fly? Place we took on the boss, right? Who was the boss? I forgot who the boss was. It's probably like one of those very forgettable bosses. Oh yeah, it was the spider, I believe. I think it, I think it was. Shit! God damn these things, I'm gonna die. I'm just gonna call this like a warm up run. Still no keys! There might be a key in here. That's Pearl. When was the last time you ever saw a key? Bomb is key bullshit. There's no way to get into the shop now unless we actually find a key. This is death. Key? That is not a key game. That's death. Shit. The problem is that the knife doesn't seem to be charging as well. Key? Nope. Nothing there. Don't miss out on the item room. We're gonna miss out on other things. Can't believe the game's doing this to me. I don't mind getting crappy items. I just don't like the fact that, uh, not getting keys. Is eternal heart. So we're going to end our heart then. Cool if we had some soul hearts and use them to actually protect the eternal hearts. That way we we use the uh, space bar item more often. I'm feeling that that flame was going to like murder me. Shit. Gotta be careful of that boom fly. Cause that thing can easily one shot us. And these things are pretty much murder us. And here comes pride game over. Yep, there it is. Let's do that again. There's a loss. Great. Oh, I'm so used to having the knife. Maybe the knife is what got me killed. You see, this these runs to be slightly complicated. Can't really call this a D6 run. Hey, look, a key. Didn't think, I didn't even think that they existed at all. on there. Thank you, game, for doing that. 
So you could go into that first room right away. First, we'll head for the item room. I'm so used to having that knife. I keep on thinking and I still have it. There's the, uh, sh the item room. And what we got? Odd mushroom. So let's crawl. Yep. I'll take it. It's damage up. Can't go wrong with that. And it also gave us an extra heart container. Uh, what else is going on? I took a break. I took a break from. Uh, maybe we should play him. I I uh, took a break from playing uh, Fire Emblem. I was talking about that. Let's go up here. Oh, I should have never picked that up. Do I want to use this? Sure. Ooh! I'll take it. Yay! I think I might actually head back and play that, uh... That, uh... Whatever that guy's called. Demon Judgment. Got that Soul Heart. And we get a fight pin. Uh, I don't think he's segmented, so I guess it doesn't really matter how we shoot him. I like technology. It's a, it's a good. Uh, ooh. It's like to fly. Uh, I like technology mainly because. Did I use a bomb? Oh, yeah, I did use a bomb. I like technology because. Oh, it doesn't, uh, doesn't have spectral shots, but because it goes across the whole screen and it pierces enemies. I think the damage is lower, though. But I don't care. I like it. See if, uh, Demon Dipshit pays out. Actually, we probably shouldn't play him because he didn't give us pretty much anything. He gave us, like, crappy items. At least I think that's how he should be working. So oh, we just wasted some time. People might be talking about that number up in the right upper right hand corner. That's for fraps. Not re I'm not using fraps. Maybe I should be. I don't know. You know if I use fraps I just don't have uh, problems with like the audio. The one thing I actually haven't played in a while is uh, Road Letter C. Try not to get ourselves murdered. We can fly now, so we could use terrain as a way to protect us. Hopefully, by going to the deal with the angel room, we uh, won't be seeing any, any more deal with devil rooms. That soul heart, even though that was probably a stupid idea. We actually had keys, therefore, we can actually go into. The we have more keys! Too bad we don't have x ray vision anymore. Over here we can pick up mom's bra. I don't want that. Actually, I probably shouldn't have picked it up. And eh, we'll just call that a uh, thing. We roll into uh, Abel. Yeah, I think once you pick it up, you have to keep it. So uh, that's just a bl uh, blunder on my part. We'll let it go just this once. I don't know. I don't really know the entire rules. It's just like briefly heard them online through like an art uh, through uh, comments in another YouTuber's video. Yeah, I'm just making the, making it up as I go. Thanks for hitting me. Um, dude, dude, yeah. Hopefully we can pick up Pythemus, that would be a pretty awesome. So this we should get our, uh, use of our space bar. Our, uh, re-roll. See, last, 
uh, last playthrough. I could have probably avoided that uh, forget-me-now if I actually picked it up the first time. Damn it. Reroll. Take the compass. Will that show me anything? Nope. Oh. Okay, let's move on. The search is working out pretty well for us. Eventually it'll probably come and bite us in the ass. There. Let's check this chest, which has money! Could use a little more damage. How much damage we were actually doing to them? Twenty. Seems like we're doing pretty decent damage. That technology's making uh, definitely making uh, these guys slightly easier. Around the caves. Uh oh. There you spawn right next to me. I definitely want to get my uh, get a charge on my D6 ready for the item room. You guys die. There we go. Just half expecting that to be an item. Sit down here. Do we want to open that chest? We know how keys are with us. Right now, is, right now, our issue are bombs. And a lot of hearts, that's pretty decent. Oh. Freaking uh, Abel over there is uh, causing some knockback. So we can have our D6 ready to go. Let's see what crap we have in here. Probably more keys, right? More hearts. And dead bird. Do we want to reroll it into something else? It's even better. Maybe. It would be better if we were doing a regular run. This run would probably be for the worse. Let's check this chest and it has Bob's run ahead. Goodbye, uh, D6. However, now we can actually look for the secret room. Let's go down here. It'll pick up a little gish. That must be lovely little gish. He's so pretty. He's so cute. Maybe you little gish. Much the best familiar in the entire game. I was sort of expecting the secret room to be to the south. See, that's why you kind of want to have the D6 ready to go before checking things that might have items. What the fuck? The flies, they swarmed all over me. Our key? Can't really go to the shop just yet. Ooh. Perfect to chill here. There we go. Taking advantage of the situation. Find the secret room, which I don't know where it is. We can actually go to the shop. Pop up. Fucking annoying enemies. I might have an idea where the seat room is. And it's not that we're gonna be wasting a bomb. Nope. I thought the top seat room would be like right over here. It's hard to tell where it could be. There's actually been times when we've had floors that didn't have any secret rooms. Ooh. Or if he's don't give me his uh, his friend. Yeah, I think he does. And uh, we pretty much hit his entire body, which is cool. No bombs though, sadly, so we can't get that tinted rock. Uh oh, some speed. Did we get lard? Was that the last when, uh, when we died? A little chat that'll come in handy if we ever find a blood bank. Let's move on. Uh, well, there's the, uh, uh, blood bank, blood bank thing. Uh, the arcade. 
if we find out how much damage we, we do. And we found our secret room, finally. And we should have enough for the shop, which probably has greed in it. They look at the map. Oh, come on. Really? I got hit by them? You guys stand right there. Good job. Get the pool in here. There's a coin. Got back my investment, which is pretty sweet. Uh, Reed's not on this floor because of uh, the uh, mini boss. Razor. Guess we had to buy it, right? It's the rules, right? Rules that we see fit. And again, I'd probably buy uh, them, which pretty much means we can't or uh, buy a key. So we don't have to worry about that. Uh, we'll get more hearts. Don't to worry about picking up the razor. Or what the razor actually does. I think it's a see item that actually injures you. We got a bare space for our item that's not kamikaze. Come on, little chat, no hearts. Uh, I think I'll, I'd rather take this than uh, Razor. It does give us some more speed. And let's just do that. And we take damage because of bullshit. Little chat, are you not dropping hearts because I'm like chilling on? Come on. Wait, pay attention. Saying Lil Chaz probably uh, not dropping hearts because I'm not on a. Uh, maybe I was wrong. So I, because I'm like chilling out like in the middle of nowhere. It's not really paying off, sadly. I'm gonna check out the uh, mob trap room. Which has uh, a bomb in it. Bomb that's not friendly. What are bombs ever friendly anyway? Anyone ever seen a bomb that had a smiley face? What the fuck just hit me? I was saying, has anyone ever s saw that coming? Could you fucking wake up? Oh, that's just great. Keep keep on taking that bullshit damage. Let's go grab that heart. So for a blood bank. Hey, little Chow's doing his job. Take on such bullshit enemies. Yeah, there's a bomb, which is pretty cool. Keys are my normal one priority, of course. Nothing there, no heart still, little Chad. And there's a heart. Who we got for mini boss? Uh, Lust. Good news, we can actually blow up this tinted rock. Come, damn it! What the fuck, Lust? Oh, I'm just gonna come alive right when I'm right when the bomb's ready to blow up. And we got here. Speed up, sweet. We got here. Speed down, even better. Oh my god, I'm so happy right now because I just got that. I fight this douchebag again. I can fly too. Therefore, your uh, shots can't hurt me, or your uh, your uh, damage in piles can't hurt me. On Derek Q and me, finally. Goodbye. Hey, look at that. We did have one play at the Blood Bane. Are you all ready? Are you? Are you? Shit up. I did say one play, right?
maybe. Ooh. Alright, I have a heart. Heart. Damn you, fucking game. Okay, statue, though. Ooh, pretty flaw. Eh, statue will definitely come in handy. I'll do one more play. It's worth it. Hate you. Okay. That's the wrong way. And, uh, we yeah, taking so much damage, we could, and if little Chad was doing his job, I would have got more uh, plays at the Blood Bane. I didn't know that that was there. Let's go back. <laughs> Let's waste time. Perfect. See? Told ya. Too bad we didn't have, uh... Like, too bad we didn't have, like, Habit and Yumhar or, uh... Or Nail or Book of Revelations. There's a Labyrinth. Great. Uh... Our buddy, uh... Reed to be on this floor. Don't have to worry about... Don't have to worry about that too much because we don't have enough money yet for the shop. Omen bombs? Yep. That's a good item. That has its uses. Go to the other item room. And, yep, this, uh... What? Why aren't you hitting him? Uh, technology works well in these assholes. That's... Bomb here. Maybe we'll get a two for one sale. Oop. More soul hearts. Leapers. Oh. Damn, why do you always have to like land at the same spot? There goes uh, one soul heart. Crap, did we get the book of revelations on this playthrough? Or was that the other one? Check out here. Ooh. Ooh, baby. Definitely take it in the nail. That slowed us down, though. I should have waited. Don't chill over here. Could have let her nail recharge, which is what I'm doing, of course. Oh, now you want to give me... Okay, there's no, uh... Boss trap room. Now you want to give me some hearts. Yeah, I'm really, really slow. Oh, what? Yeah, the draw hoof will help us out. And we're definitely going to check out that chest, because why not? Oh shit! Still would like to have another damage up. We got a key, which is cool. Look at the size of that laser beam. Should probably take out these guts, because... Hazard. Oh, what are you up to? Thank you, little Chad. Now you actually pay out. What? Well, you're not allowed to slide like that. Oh, I'm just going to slide right into him. Not going to jump. Let's go check up here. I'm tired. That's yeah, first week of school. It's, uh, well, it's the end of the first week of school. And yeah, nothing really too special. Just reading a bunch of dumb shit. 
It's probably the wrong way. Well, the wrong way I should be going. Use that. Let's probably take damage. Yeah, it was by far the best item to have right now. I'm about to match each max HP. What the hell did I just run into? Hopefully we can actually make use of that blood bane finally. Oh, come on. Poison touch would have been good there. Boss room is to the left. Only we had habit. That would definitely come in handy for that uh upcoming blood bane. Yeah, of course you're allowed to shoot even though I I did damage to you. Hate these things so much. What the fuck was that? Did you see him just like charge at me? Little chance paying off some more. Try to get them uh, walk on the spikes. Uh, we go into the first boss room, of course. Let's go and have a monstro. Or I mean, monstro two. Since we have the laser beam, not bad. Got a lot of HP though. We're doing fairly little damage. The nail actually charges up. One more, ba one more charge, baby. One more. There we go. Now we can do more damage. Not that we had a uh, fly love on our head. This is like takes forever with our amount of damage. Almost dead though. We're doing about like nine damage. What do you got for me? A bean? Damn it. Goodbye, nail. Oh man. So far there's hearts in a lot of rooms. There's a heart there. Just don't count them all as half of a heart at, at the moment. What the bean does. I think it's like a poison gas effect. Be wrong, could be right. It is poison gas or a poison touch? And let's pick up the pill, speed up. Definitely need that. Pick that up, we'll get the magician, which won't do anything for us. This way, you tackle this guy, you shoot him like this, do massive damage. I don't really have enough for a shop yet. Hmm. Still getting the slowdown, and I still believe that that is from uh, from playing this uh, mod. Because we never had the issue of playing just regular binding and advise it. Oh crap! Hey, I learned some other some other new tricks. I hope to show off. A lot of bombs. Where the hell did I get all these bombs from? More hearts are always nice. I really hate these enemies. Especially in a room like this. Best to uh, keep as far away as possible. Or bombs, of course. Ooh, red chest. Maybe that might have something cool in it. It has spiders. What's more cool? What's cooler than spiders? Everything. Now for this uh, one of my classes, I uh, I actually have to. Uh, 
do video logs. It's for like a general class that like, everyone's required to take. There's uh, like different subjects uh, that uh, that they discuss in the class, just so they don't say, "Hey, you got to take QU201." And even though it's something you probably have absolutely no damn care about, you still have to take it. Yeah, let's spend like over like three thousand, like ten thousand dollars for one class that we have absolutely no use for. This class, however, this QU uh, 101 class is actually uh, 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 actually sports officiating, which is pretty cool. Cause I actually like sports, and the teacher seems pretty cool. Hopefully, he's laid back enough so that we, I don't really have to put that much effort into the class. Or some more important things like my actual major. That's something that I had to spend my money on that I probably I probably get something out of it because I do like sports. I've been using the bean too much. Let's use it on the it's that guy. He deserved it. So why was I talking about this? I don't know if I actually mentioned the reason to begin with, but we actually have to do uh, video logs for the class. Which kind of like Oh, we haven't even got to, found the way to the uh, arcade yet. So, it's uh, amazing that they're having us do, uh, do the video logs. It's a weird thing. I think, I think, oh, he does a uh, let's play, so he's used to it. <laughs> what did I say? Reed was going to show up. And that's true, but it's still weird. Like I do let's plays for people that I have app that I don't know, I don't know in person. If we were, if I were to know you, but if we were to like meet in person, it'd be like because of gaming, it wouldn't be because oh we're friends. Hey, go like big we're like old time buddies. Hey, go watch my videos and look what look at. Oh, thanks, thanks for teleporting me to the room just uh, beforehand. Uh, hey, we're best friends. Watch me be, watch my videos of me being a complete nerd. That's definitely awesome. Go. So yeah, I gotta do V large for the class. Yes, I got to. Uh, uh, give, uh, give my opinions about like what happened in like uh, sports and fishing. Like, watch sport and something. Like, I'd probably talk about the uh, uh, girls' basketball game that I watched tonight with the horrible uh, officiating. It's weird. Let's just play this in right now. Please pay out. So you probably see some of those video logs like on my YouTube channel. I don't know if I actually want to put them on main YouTube channel or just make a new one. I don't really have much use for money anymore. What do we got here? Hermit card. And our pill. Tears down. Don't really know if that has any effect on us. I don't really want to play that. So I pretty much brought the subject because I like doing video logs for an actual class where people I don't know if their classmate sees it or just a teacher, but like I do this just for people that don't know me, so you make fun of me. I don't really have to worry about like oh knowing you in real life and hey and uh, all sorts of shit like that. Pick up the parts. And also uh it does seem weird. Uh, it, well, that's not half of a heart. 
That's a half of heart. It's weird, in my opinion, because that boom flies don't murder me, I bet. Oh, well, not weird. Well, it is weird. Sort of. I don't know, I'm going. But, um. Uh, that also means that, uh, the professor expects you to have the, uh, the hardware and the software to actually, uh, do the recordings for this. Not about you, but is there, does everyone now have, like, webcams and, like, headsets or, or microphone to, do, to, like, do this? Do they have, uh, does everyone have the editing software as well? I don't really know any other way to uh, do you. T uh, I know you can use a webcam, of course. I guess most laptops these days have webcams. I don't know, do they? Does every laptop have like a webcam or something? Got any good spacebar items lately? Or any at all? Is that? There's a microphone. I don't really think every single computer has a built in mic. So a person would have to actually buy a mic and maybe a uh, webcam. It's more expense towards a stool. Let's see, what else? Which is going to pay off. And there's the editing software. I don't, don't know if you like just like. Give me the heart. Damn it. I don't know if they could like just record like raw footage and just upload it that way or if they actually have to like do uh, some editing to upload to YouTube. I could use this as my video log. <laughs> actually it would have been cool if the QU2 one class was like, ooh about video games. What's the time am I at? I'm at uh, 52 minutes already. That would be a pretty uh, awesome Q class. Or if they actually have one like that. Well, I still have to take a Q301 class. So the way that uh, these bullshit Q classes are is like, uh, like QU101 uh, is supposed to like teach you about... I'm just going to pick this one up wherever it is. Supposed to teach you about like your uh, local culture, like this, I guess the school culture, culture, and then uh, 201 is like the national culture, and then 301 is supposed to be about like the world culture. Sounds like a bunch of bullshit, right? It is. I need bombs, I need hearts. As I said, I don't need bombs, I need hearts. I think I'll go, I think I might go to bed after this. After I'm done with this. So of course there's many uh many uh like unknowns about about the video login. I live in the past. I don't know if I told you this. I was born in that generation. So I'm now in, not like, uh, ooh, super into, I'm not like really, really into all that technology, like all that multitasking. I wonder where the secret, oh crap, I was definitely not there. It's over here. You people might be all into, uh, into doing all the multitasking, doing all the video logging and stuff like that. I myself feel weird about talking about myself on camera. That's why I do uh, let's plays. No, I didn't want to go that way. Let's check over here. Could it be here? Which I wish it was. Oh, it could also be over here as well. Wait to just bomb into the. Uh, damn it! I think it'll be next to the boss room. Yeah, so those are my thoughts.
see how well it goes. People to all rate me on how bad I am at doing a vi at doing the video log. Maybe I might actually cut stuff in. Just have fun with it. I know a person like SKS would enjoy it. Eh. And let's do like another play the blood bank and then uh let's go fight the heart. Or mom, whatever it's called. It's bad enough that I can barely uh, focus on saying things while do while actually playing game. See that leads to me getting my ass here. Oh wait, back on, on uh Metal Gear uh solid. I was thinking about maybe doing a uh a let's like a let's play series of it. Oh crap. Goodbye, Blood Bank. <laughs> Barely knew ye. Barely any rooms on this floor. Just so I need more bombs. Yeah, let's get out of here. I should have just blown the guy up. Yeah, so I was thinking about doing Metal Gear Solid a playthrough. Of course, it's kind of hard to do like a Metal Gear Solid playthrough because in order for it to be good, you, have to, you actually have to be good at the game. I would consider myself more of a casual player. And in order to be good, you have to uh, pretty much be able to play the game without uh, killing anyone. You also uh, uh, you also have to be able to play the game without uh, getting alert phases. Maybe we should get the nail. Uh, let's uh, let's cheese the fight. Oh yeah. I knew that was going to hit me. God damn it, walk right into that stupid thing. Now, the trick, the good trick is to just, like, leave the, uh... Uh, leave the easy enemies on the screen that, like, can't hurt you. If this guy wants to hurt me, I probably should have moved. That way, uh... You only have like three enemies on screen. But if you have three easy enemies on screen, then you won't worry about getting your ass here. I did. I use a hermit card to get out of here. Goodbye. Blood bank is gone, right? Yeah, poison touch. Finally. Up our Polaroid. Got enough speed, right? Yep. Let's move on. Curse of the Lost. Sweet. Do I want this? Of course not. But. I guess, uh. I guess the, uh, speed. The, uh, tears down. Slows down my, uh. Uh, shot fire. See how life flitters on and off. And that was just stupid. Uh oh, I'm like tired. It's getting the best of me. It's not playing like shit like it did in the first playthrough. I'm kinda worried that that might have been Monstro too. Love how I have like two orbiters. Yeah, I still get hit. I really hate fighting these guys. I, I could use probably tears up. I don't think I could make it to the chest unless I get like her damage power up. Which I think I'm willing to go to uh, deal with the devil room. Oh well, yeah, a library would have been good because it would it wouldn't have the books in it because of this uh, of the universal item pool. I thought of that. This is the second enemy. It is. No, it's the third one. Who was the second one? I think it was Chubbs. Not doing well on HP. Actually, I still have a Peace Walker turned on. Oh, there goes more HP. Really wish we could get a space bar item. Because I was expecting to. Maybe I'll play a little bit more Peace Walker after uh, 
done with this. Thank you for hitting me. Evil's been doing a pretty decent job. Oh, thank you. Hollow. I ran right into that. Give me a full heart. And I even be able to make it to mom. I'll be just to start talking about things. Talked about Metal Gear Solid in, in the other one, and I got myself killed there. Started talking about random bullshit here, and I and now I'm down to like half of a heart. And now we got to uh, fight this room, and we can't bomb out. What the fuck? And we're dead. All because we couldn't bomb out of the room. So that was Yes Man, whatever it was called. And we'll probably do another one uh, soon. So until next time, it's been Brian DC0313 saying see you and have a good day.